my channel Glow with Candace, and if you're new here, welcome. I'd love to see you back on my channel. So hit the subscribe button down below to see future videos like this and more by me. And don't forget, hit that notification bell as well so you can be notified for any future uploads of mine. Today, I'm going to be going over my top five favorite eyeshadow palettes at this moment in time. And I have brands from drugstore all the way to high end, so that way there is a palette for everybody. And I just wanna show you guys my favorite ones and why I love them so much. So the first eyeshadow palette I have is from ColourPop, and I love ColourPop because they make such beautiful stuff. Um, they're always making new things and their palettes are super pigmented and super affordable, so ColourPop is definitely one of my favorite um, makeup brands for eyeshadows. Um, and this palette I have, I absolutely love, and it is the ColourPop Blush Crush Palette. This palette is very beautiful. It is a nine pan palette, and it has just beautiful, pink, mauve nude colors, and this is just gorgeous. I love this palette so much. I feel like I can do a lot of different looks. It's so pigmented, and I just, it goes with the kind of looks I like to give, and it's just beautiful. This palette retails for $14, but ColourPop always has different sales, so sometimes you can get it for cheaper. I feel like this palette is almost a dupe and better than a high-end palette that I have. I purchased also the Huda Beauty Nude Palette, and it is gorgeous by all means, and as you can see, I've hardly used it because I was actually a little bit disappointed when I bought it. It doesn't give me as many looks as I would have hoped for, especially for the price that I paid. And not only that, but when I bought this palette, I thought, oh my gosh, these colors are similar and more pigmented and cheaper. So I'm actually, I love this ColourPop palette way more than the Suda Beauty one. It's sad because I wanted this palette so bad and I remember when I got it, I was so excited and then I've used it a few times and I'm like, you know, I'm not really like thrilled with it. Like it's beautiful, but I feel like I get more looks and more color payoff with my ColourPop nine pan palette for $14 versus this one where I did not pay nearly that, I paid much more. So um, to me, I feel like it's a pretty similar dupe. Of course, this um, Huda Beauty one has a few more colors and sparkles, but as you can see, the color range is very similar here. So if you're looking for a cheaper option for a dupe, definitely go with this ColourPop one because I feel like they're very similar and the ColourPop one is much better in my opinion. As you can see, I don't really reach for this one. It's really sad because I wanted this so bad and I was so excited. I got it a few Christmases ago with a Christmas gift card to Sephora and it just wasn't, it wasn't as great as I was hoping it was gonna be. Um, but my ColourPop Crush Blush, oh my gosh, excuse me, Blush Crush. So very cute. So I'll leave the links down below, of course, of all these eyeshadow palettes, where you can buy them, and of course, the prices. The next palette I have is from Too Faced, and I absolutely love this palette. I've had it for ages, and you'll be able to see when I open it. It is the Too Faced Sweet Peach Eyeshadow Palette. I love Too Faced um, for many different reasons. Their packaging's beautiful, and I also love their products. They're definitely really nice, and I love the formula of these tin palettes. For whatever reason, their tin eyeshadow palettes are just the best. I mean, I love them. Um, the colors are, the packaging is beautiful, and the colors of this palette are just beautiful. As you can see, I have used this palette. You have browns, you have pinks, just beautiful colors. And the fun perk too, is it scented with peach. Um, I've had this for so long that unfortunately the scent is no longer there, but when I first bought it, of course it did smell like peaches. This palette though is so beautiful. It gives just such beautiful browns with a pop of pink and peachy colors. I just love it so much, and this is a perfect eyeshadow palette for a lot of everyday looks. I tend to gravitate towards browns and pinks. That's just 
kind of what I like and I love pink so this palette has a nice mixture of just those colors and they just go well together, they blend nicely. I just can't get over this palette. Definitely one of my top five favorites. And this eyeshadow palette is an 18 pan palette and it retails for $49. And Too Faced, of course, is also a cruelty-free brand. This next eyeshadow palette is also one of my top five favorites. I guess I should stop saying that because, of course, these are all my top fives. So you're probably like, okay, we get it. These are all your favorite. But this palette, I love. And it brings back so much nostalgia because I bought it before my honeymoon. And I used it on my honeymoon in Hawaii. And it's kind of like really awesome because it's hanging in Hawaii. So if you don't catch the drift yet, it's from BH Cosmetics and it's the Hanging in Hawaii eyeshadow palette. This is a 16 pan palette and it is absolutely gorgeous. BH Cosmetics is of course another one of my favorite brands, particularly for eyeshadow and blush and really just anything. This palette is absolutely gorgeous. Since I purchased it a few years back, they have changed the outer packaging. It's still really pretty, but it doesn't look like this anymore. Um, these colors though, absolutely beautiful. I love all the names, the theme, and just absolutely gorgeous. I'm actually wearing this on my eyes today. So it gives you just a nice, beautiful look. You can go with browns, a pop of pink. These are just gorgeous. You have some shimmers. I just love this. I mean, the names are adorable, like Hula, Shaka, Hibiscus, Luau, Ohana, Pineapple, Lei, Aloha, Tiki, Sandy, Coconut, Paradise, Maui, Waikiki, Mahalo, and Honolulu. So I just, it's so much fun. And BH Cosmetics, I love their eyeshadow palettes. So blendable, so pigmented, and super affordable. This 16 pan palette retails for $17, but there's always great deals for BH Cosmetics, so you can definitely get it cheaper. I believe at Ulta, not too long ago, they were near 50% off, if not 50% off. So you definitely get a good bang for your buck. Um, this eyeshadow palette, I just love, love, love. Um, like I said, the outer packaging is different now. Um, they updated it, but obviously they've kept this eyeshadow palette around, so it must be a nice staple. And this eyeshadow palette just gives me so much good vibes because I got it when I was getting ready to get married and then I purchased it for my honeymoon to wear, um, you know, because we went to Maui for our honeymoon, so. It's just, and this was the only eyeshadow palette that I took on our honeymoon. I thought, I am gonna utilize this in Hawaii because it's hanging in Hawaii. So, um, and it did everything I needed it to while we were in Hawaii, when we went on dates, um, when we went out to a nice dinner. So, I absolutely love this eyeshadow palette and I couldn't say more that you need to go get it. And BH Cosmetics is also a cruelty-free brand. Like I said, I am wearing this on my eyes today, so I'm just gonna give you guys a close-up on my eye look. Also, my dogs are chewing on dog bones right now, so if you're hearing noise in the background, that's just my pups enjoying some treats. <laughs> This next eyeshadow palette I have is from e.l.f. Cosmetics and it is the Naked Prism eyeshadow palette. Now this is an eyeshadow palette of six colors and I apologize, this is so messy, but I've used this for a very long time and a lot as you can see. These are all shimmers, so also be aware when you purchase this, they are all shimmers, um, but they are all a beautiful like brown and light colors there. I absolutely love this if I'm going for a kind of like brown shimmery look and I just want all shimmer. This is one of my first eyeshadow palettes I ever purchased when I was really starting to get into makeup and exploring, and I absolutely love this palette. I feel like if I'm wanting to go with just a shimmery look with some browns, it is absolutely gorgeous. They are just so pretty. Look at just how shimmery this is. So, 
I love this palette, but of course it is if you are going with a certain kind of look. And of course, since it's only a six pan palette, there's not a ton of options, but it's a nice like grab and go. And as you can see, it's pretty messy in here. So I've also had it a while, I've used it a lot. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> and it comes with this little guy, I do not use that. I use my brushes, of course. Um, but it's just nice to have in case you need to just dab something in there. I think this is a nice, like, punch for pigmentation with just a little um, eyeshadow palette. So definitely love this guy. Um, and it retails for $10, and you can currently purchase it on the e.l.f. Cosmetics website. And e.l.f. Cosmetics is a cruelty-free brand. The fifth eyeshadow palette that I am gonna share with you guys is from Lorac. Now, for the longest time, I've always said it wrong, so if you watch some of my previous videos, I probably say Lorac, which, what it looks like, right? But it's actually pronounced Lorac. But this palette from Lorac is probably one of my go-to eyeshadow palettes just because it gives such beautiful looks. It's super pigmented, and it's kind of in between a really, really expensive price, but not a super cheap price either. This is the Lorac Unzipped Eyeshadow Palette. This is a 10-pan palette, and it retails for $35 so it's definitely like an in-between price and these colors in here are just gorgeous if you're looking for some brown some gold type colors this is pretty you can get a lot of different looks especially if you like to play on the safer side this eyeshadow palette is perfect for those kind of things and to give you those nice brown neutral looks that is an everyday look these are super pigmented I cannot I love Lorac um, eyeshadow palettes, particularly their unzipped formulas are just really amazing. Um, this, like I said, is a 10 pan palette. This eyeshadow palette has been around for a while. I've had this one for quite a while as well. This is actually my first eyeshadow palette from Lorac and it's kind of what got me really intrigued with the Lorac brand. From there I started exploring with the highlighters and finding out my love for that as well. So definitely love this eyeshadow palette. It is a must have in your collection if you want these kind of colors. Sounds like Lorac isn't really straightforward if they are cruelty free or not. It sounds like they themselves do not test on animals, but they don't certify that their suppliers test on animals. So I'll leave that with a grain of salt and you can decide. Thanks for stopping by with Glow with Candace. I hope you enjoyed this video on my top five favorite eyeshadow palettes at this time. If you like what you saw, please hit the like button down below. And if you're new here and wanna see future videos like this and more by me, hit the subscribe button. I'd love to see you back on my channel. But until next time, bye.